Hey, welcome back everyone. It is uh, August 20th. It's close to 4 o'clock now. I'm here to check out my cameras. Uh, the last time I was here, I, I put down some salt. I kind of dig two holes and put some salt down right next to a watering hole. And then I got the camera set up right in front of the watering hole. So hopefully there's going to be some good pictures on that. Uh, this is the camera that takes over 10,000 pictures because it's really sensitive. I took it home and kind of played with it, tried to change the settings, and hopefully it actually uh, took some decent pictures and not as much pictures as last time. So I'm going to go over and check it out. So the first thing I noticed that the salt has been found, that there are some prints. It is kind of scattered a bit, so that's the first one, and then here's the second one. I can actually see some uh, turkey signs in there. See a little bit of footprints. So that's that's a good sign. So over to the camera. So I just wanted to show you guys where I put my camera. There's the camera and then there's the watering hole. I'll be checking the pictures on a card reader that I just got uh, just yesterday. It's the Stealth Cam card reader. So here you go. It's actually pretty neat. Uh, this is going to be the first day that I'll be using it. I know if there's a little chickadee right there. He's not even flying around. But yeah, it's going to be the first time I'll be using this. So I kind of played around with it at home uh, before we came out here. Now uh, the pictures look good. So it also tells you how many pictures that are on your camera. So I'm going to head over and grab the card. So I think the camera is not functioning right because it says that I have 8,400 pictures. Because you know, last time I had around over 10,000. So there's there must be something wrong with this camera. That's why I went out and uh, bought two new ones, and I went out and got some Wild Game Innovations. I like Wild Game Innovations because I got one camera, which is my one camera that's on my spot. That outlasted every single camera that I have because I bought that camera and this camera six months apart and that one has lasted a lot longer than this camera and my other cameras and wild game innovations you know their cameras are at a decent price uh, I got mine on sale so I had a killer deal on both of them so I ended up getting the the glow cake and the vision 12 so I'll be uh, setting up my vision 12 on this one yes I'll be replacing this one I'd it's pissing me off so what I might, might be doing is getting rid of it so I might have like a giveaway giving away this camera to one of you guys so I'm just gonna sit here and look through and once I see a good size buck I'll let you guys know so I've been going through the pictures there was a group of turkey and now the so I've been going through the pictures, there's really nothing there. There's a group of turkeys and I just found a fawn that still has its spots. Not sure if you guys can see it, but the fawn's down at the bottom. And it's right there, it's pretty cool. So if there's a fawn, then mama's around. So I'm gonna continue scro scrolling and see if there's any bucks. So after flipping through hundreds of pictures, I finally found some bucks and it's a group of three. There's a four, three, and a two in there. I'm gonna try to show you guys the pictures, but I'm not sure how clear it's gonna show. So if it doesn't, then I'm gonna have to take, it, take a picture from my phone because this thing doesn't save pictures. I don't know why, but it doesn't. So I'm gonna try my best to show you guys so this is going to be the first guy. He's at the four point. Hopefully you guys can see it. There might be a glare. So I'm going to move at different angles. So that's the first guy. Ah, oh, it turned off. So there. There's that guy. He's actually pretty tall. Here's the... The three point, 
He's over here. And then the other guys, you know, he's he's just a little guy, so no reason to show him, show you guys. But I noticed that the deer around here, they're pretty tall. They're going, they're pretty kind of like growing straight up instead of going wide. But this camera is kind of pissing me off because it's taking pictures like every 15 seconds. And there's a lot of weeds around here. So when they sway with the wind, the camera's going to obviously take pictures of that. So I can I know that there's deer here because when I'm looking through the pictures, I can see the deer in the fields in the background. So I'm not sure if I should set up my other camera where that my I'm not sure if I should set up the new camera in that spot or put it in the corner over here in the field so I can have it angled towards the field and see if I see any deer there. I don't know. I'm just going to sit here, scroll through some more pictures, and hopefully I'll find my more bucks. I'm going to put the camera in the original spot. This is the Wild Game Innovation uh, Vision 12. Picked it up yesterday at a decent price. Uh, I told you guys how I feel about these cameras. So you guys should go out there and grab a couple for yourselves. So I'm just going to set this guy up and then gonna go to the first spot and check those camera and check that camera out so I'm at the the first camera and it's taking 91 pictures and I was surprised because I thought there was gonna be more because last time when I was here when I checked there was some nice looking bucks in here so when I went through the pictures there was only like one or two and they're small guys and then several does uh, it's kind of weird I'm trying to think of a different spot to put this camera because uh, one of the limbs just decided to go right in front of the camera and I think that's what's triggering triggering it because most of the pictures was just nothing just empty just this scene the scenic right here that that's all that I was on the camera so I don't know. Thinking about putting it in a different spot. But yeah, I uh, just want to apologize to you guys that I haven't been posting up uh, any vi videos. It's been a while since I've done that. Uh, I'm going to be super late too because I made videos in uh, early, what is it, uh, late June and early July. So I'll be probably posting those up before I post this one. So I'm trying to trying to do my best you guys I've been busy lately so this is kind of tough but hopefully you guys just stay tuned and watch my videos and comment like share uh, do what you want so hopefully some big bucks will show up on these cameras uh, before the the season starts so here in Washington the season will start off September 1st and then early goose is starting up too September 9th that, that weekend so I'm getting ready for that I'm flocking my my goosenecks and the heads. So once I finish that, I should be ready to go. Alright, you guys. I uh, hope you guys like this video. If not, put a thumbs down. If you, if you like it, thumbs up. Uh, leave a comment below, you guys. I've yet to see a couple of you guys. Leave a comment. So, much appreciated if you guys do. Alright, you guys. Uh, see you guys later.